G'day guys, my name's Josh, you can call me Zaboodle, and welcome back to 7 Days to Die. We're back in Alpha 20, coming into day 18 of our Mega City series, and so far... I mean, I think things are going pretty well. We've had some bad luck along the way, but for the most part, we've achieved a lot of the things that we wanted to. Maybe just slower than I initially wanted to. There's a demon doggo all the way down there. I'll steer clear of you for the moment and just perch up in my lovely, lovely secondary base at the top of the town hall and look out over my surroundings. But I'm coming back with some bad news. At the end of the last episode, I was trying to make myself a workbench which I'm very close to doing. I'm short six forged iron though, which is what I used to make myself the wrench and the hammer. So I'm gonna have to find some sort of workstation somewhere out there anywhere to break down to get the iron, but that's gonna be A-OK. -okay. Chuck you guys away because as promised, first thing I'm doing today is heading out and I'm gonna go open all of these boxes. Got one here and three across the street over there, ripe and ready for the opening. It's gonna be a big day, a big morning. Have a loot for breakfast. Excuse me, everybody. Just gonna weave my way through. We have lots of mad muppets at me in a moment, but that's okay. Get a little bit of distance, whip out the old pistol and... Oh, jeez. Okay, okay, game. It's all right. Calm your farm. I don't know why things are that broken, but you're having a bit of a moment, apparently. Just have a nice, easy morning. Nice, easy cup of coffee and a bit of a shoot, bit of a shoot and range to get your eye in. Make sure you're all ripe and ready to go. Yep, yep, there you go. Just had to sort your shit out, I see. That's all fine. In fact, do you guys even know where I am or can I just go like that? Get self damage. Yes, I bloody can. Easy as. So this was the first joint. It was actually like one of the boxes on top of the cracker book there. Which I still feel cheap about because I didn't raid the entire quaddy joint to get to it. I just jumped across on the roof next door. But that cracker book might also... Oh. Oh. All right. Apparently, Copy Boy brought his girlfriend out on a call because someone was firing guns out here before. Not the safest environment to bring your new best friend. I doubt you paid her enough to come out on that kind of run. I missed that shot woefully too. Hang on a jiffy, just like... Oh, come on! Hit the bloody Muppet! I've given up, and I've just gone with guns instead. Ooh, and... Oh, there's a lot of them out here. Is this like a bit of a wandering horde or something? But it might be because there's... Oh, <laughs> was a feral. Missed it. Missed it. There we go. God, the knife is looking better and better every time I whip that purple blade of goodness out of its scabbard. Hit you... Damn it! I wanted the extra XP. I'm getting greedy with it. Okay, now that we've done that, though, now that most of the clowns down here are dead, can I sneak my way in, jump across the roof again, and grab the boxing at the side? Though I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty tempted just to hit up the um the cracker book that it's on the roof of. I mean, I might find something good in there. You never know. This was the jump. Make sure my stamina is max. Yes, it is. So, do I pop the candy now, or do I try and loot the cracker book first? How greedy do I want to get with this? I mean, it is loot, and I'm nothing but a loot fiend, so I may just get greedy with it. I think there's a window there is just out the back that I can use. Let's grab a rampy block up to there. Nice and simple. Oh, g'day, buddy boy. Don't mind me. Just got to scooch all in on your quiet reading time. Nice and easy. You probably got some other friends in there too. I'll deal with them all the same way. You can all cuddle with bolts through your face. This is my first time in one of these cracker books in Alpha 20, and it's looking a bit more stacked than I remember them being. I've been through plenty of cracker books on many of my journeys when I've been fawning over myself to try and find any of the missing literature that I'm always looking for. I mean, if... Even though the tradition of finding nothing but rubbish paper and books is still going strong, it's good to know I've got more opportunities to be disappointed. You know, just everywhere I look is another chance to be sad. No one's spawned in yet, so just drop down. Murder you. Oh, I almost landed on Arlene, and you didn't even notice, love. I mean, I know... <laughs> I know a lot of the things I've done with you, you haven't really physically felt, but if I, f I felt like most of my body clattering your earlobes might have got a bit more of a reaction. We'll start out with the back room where there's the Cracker Book shipping boxes. This is supposed to be a quick little, ooh. Uh, scrounge up more? Find more food in, uh, okay. 
read the words rush we'll tell you what it says far more food and loot nice take you but yeah i am um, this was supposed to be like a quick little morning raid just opening up the hardened chest but apparently we're doing a whole lot more cripple and bots comedic thank you already got that book but more importantly pistol peep volume two each successive leg shot with the same target will increase the chance of cripple by 10 percent I feel like I've been going relatively well with headshots lately, but always nice to know I have a secondary option for when I let myself down and shank all my very precious shots. Nope, nothing then. It's going to be the <laughs> the way of the tide today, I think. Just finding paper after paper after paper. But if I find one or two books out of here, I'll be stoked. Didn't take nearly as long to get through as I thought it would. We've found an extra $150 dues in the cash register. Apparently this place is doing pretty well. Definitely not run by Bernard, that's for sure. Right, so I did find a couple of things. I found Wasteland Treasure Volume 4. I can make Purified Water now and a four times scope mod schematic. And also, I forgot to save it. I uh, also found a ratchet schematic. I can't make good tools. And other than like the impact driver, not really worthwhile anyway. But always good to have another thing unlocked. I missed you on the way through. Not that it mattered anyway. Got the rest of you guys. All right, we're good to go. Let's yeet ourselves out the window and go to what we came here for. Stop getting distracted by shiny things. Oh, wow. There is like a uh, a whole host of Muppets coming over. Apparently, they're really annoyed that I raided their local horns. Arlene, go away. Like, if I could one-shot all of these guys, that would be sick as anything. See, oh, oh, Loza coming at me quick. Or is this? Oh, is this a wandering horde? It must be. There's so many of them. There's so many. Come on, make it count. There you go. As long as I hit them once, they're usually okay because they do slow down. So this is the secondary shot that I keep shanking. Right. Okay. We good? That was a lot. Okay. Now that we've done all that, I can clear out some of my inventory. I'll just drink you now to give me some better uh, digestive efficiency. That can piss off. Um, rest of you guys can stay, I suppose. All right. You give me 10 minutes of lockpick and goodness. So enough time to do all four of these. Yes, I have some extra lockpicks now, but I'd rather just save them for a rainy day and do all this now and get it up and out of the way. Fingers and toes is crossed with some decent loot, though. These are some pretty serious loot containers. There should be good gubbins. I've worked hard for it. Reward my good sweaty efforts with... Uh, okay. Nail gun schematic. I didn't know I realized I could make my own anvils. I didn't think I had that schematic yet, but that's all nice and good. Gold nuggies are worthless. The rest of this stuff can all come with me, though. I mean, it hurts me. It hurts me to throw it away, but I kind of have to, because what else am I going to do with it? Goodbye, shiny rocks. Hopefully someone who values you more will find you later. Open up the next one and see what she got for me. There we go. Ooh, Iron Crossbow Schematic. Already got, I mean, I haven't got any points in Archery Ammo, so I can't make a better one, but I suppose having a schematic to do something with it is good. Also, time charges is really good find, actually. So if I do run out of lockpicks, I can use those much easier. Take the rest of you. Nice. The next one is underneath that building over there, isn't it? So I've done what I haven't done you. I skipped a building over to the next bit. Nice. Okay. Well, let's drop all the way down. Got parkour so it shouldn't hurt us. Down to them. Nice and easy. Yep, yep, it's fine. It's fine. There may be zombies about and the wind may have picked up, but I'm not worried. I've got loot to get. Easy as. There we go. That, lo that uh, lockpicking candy is working a treat. Ooh. Oh! That is two of the sexiest things I've seen in a while. Admittedly, it's been a long time since I laid my eyes on Jen, but even so, Crucible Schematic, give me you. And treasure map now it may not seem that exciting given there's no traders but finding like a big chunk of dollar dues will take care of all of my snack funds going forward and it's down probably actually like either off the coast or near the coast but hopefully in the desert thank you tay tay i'll get down there and see what you got for me in a jiffy now the last block that i need the box rather that i needed was the one back at home do a quick little you banger and get back up me ladders this has been successful so far. I'm really hoping that because this is actually in the town hall, so my loot stage in here should be better than all of the other POIs I've been to this morning. Uh, 76 was the same as the one I was just at. So maybe another treasure map. Ooh, no, that's okay though. Triple storage pocket mod, shotgun parts, some money, but no. Okay, not as good as the last one, I'll admit, but still pretty bloody bonza. So that's going to open up the last of my... <laughs> 
or the last of my um, uh, carrying capacity, but I can't do it because my helmet's not good enough to stack it in. Fuck. Yeah, do I have a bando mod on? Yes, I do. All right, let's chuck this stuff away. And I reckon... Oh, it's five minutes. I'm not sure if I have enough time to do it, but I reckon I might just have enough time to get out to Taylor's treasure map now and see what she's got. I'll take you with me just in case. You guys can hang out in there. That can just piss off. All right, let's crack on. Let's go see what's buried in the desert. Now, nah, there's no way I have enough time. I've got five minutes left of the lockpicking candy, and I'm pedaling my spaghetti legs as fast as these floppy noodles can carry me. There's no way I'm going to make it out there. It's just not going to happen. Stripper titties is long for the ride, though. She, she came out with Copy Boy before to see what was going on. Oh, oh, yep, there we go. And apparently found something better, i.e. me. While I'm at it, I may as well... Oh, hello, love. May as well not put it to waste. There's an ATM here, and i still got lockpicking going, so might find some extra dollar we do's. Those are footsteps. Oh God, it's at the door next to me. I thought it was kind of behind. That's all right, I got time. I mean, I may have a 100% efficiency picking, but it definitely doesn't go by quickly. Come on, dollar dues. Not money, just tokens. Don't know who retrofitted it, but I've got my fingers crossed. Damn it. We're almost to the outskirts of the city. The mountain range is just over there. And I'm not, I'm not too far away. Oh, how you bloody doing gorgeous. That is a shooting range which is prime, oh God, <laughs> sorry bud, which is prime looting potential. Need you to die though, let get back on my bike again. There we go. That's very tempting for afterwards. Yeah, they're, oh, we're actually further away from the ocean than I thought we are. We may, may have a decent shot of this. We're out into the farmland. What are you gonna have for me? Well, we've got two, three minutes left. We might make it, we're this close. I'm not stopping. I'm not stopping for the magpie, although the buried, the buried treasure is outside of uh, of the desert, which kind of sucks. So the loot stage drops considerably. Dang. Okay. Well, two minutes. Nothing for it. Let's just get at it and see if we can find it quick. Oh, man. Look, I got like 30 feet that way. I'm way more excited about this. Oh, God. There's the yellow circle. So it's back over this way. Uh, maybe it's time to bust out some of the old tricks. Maybe it's time to go back to the Southwest trick. I don't think it works that well in Alpha 20. I still haven't seen any, like, proper theories on what the new way to find buried treasure is. So I've, I've got a minute. May as well try the Southwest one instead. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Give me some love. If I ever needed some luck, it was right now. It is kind of moving in this direction, though, so we might have a shot at it. Oh, fucking how you doing? How you fucking doing, you locked box of goodness? Spread open and let me devour ya. With a minute to spare, the fucking Southwest streak. That doesn't mean that it definitely works, but it works now. And fuck me as it got me tingly. What's in ya? What's bleeding in ya? Oh, two and a half thousand dollar in dues. Fuck yes. Fuck, I'm a happy boy. Moza. Did you see my endeavors just then? It's blown my mind and it probably yeah, blew your mind too. That has got me seven ways of tingly from any day of the week. <laughs> that could not have gone better. That could not have gone bloody better. Plus I'm fighting hunting, hunting in tree stumps. I can't even talk anymore. Oh man, I need, I just need to go home. I need to go find Jen and retire because I'm never having a better day than this. So that's the coastline down there. Where should I be raiding? I'm so, so far away from home now. Look how far I've gone from my actual house. That's on the other side of the bleeding world at this point. Hmm, where's the next best placement to go? I'll have a little squeeze down here. Hmm, no, that's the place that's got like the burial site underneath it. I'm not really feeling that one. I'm looking for tools. I just can't get over how much money I have now, though. That's ridiculous. All of my sweet treats can now be bought without any sort of hindrance at all. I'm like a kid in a candy store, almost literally. This little spot down here just caught my eye because there's the house that I had in, um, uh, what was it, Horde Every Night, 8922 Pelican Plaza just then, right next to the bloody clock tower. So my uh, both of my Alpha 20 bases are sitting pretty, looking at each other and swapping stories at the time they had Woodle inside them. Very short stories, I promise you. But I'm gonna quickly raid both of these, both for nostalgia, but also for relatively easy loot. It's good to be back. It's good to be back, buddy. Do you bong yet? No. 
I just want someone to ring my bell in the best way possible. Excuse me, chair. Check the weapons bag. Shady parts. Don't need club parts, though. Ah, uh, scrap you. All the way. Oh, someone's grown. Oh, God. Someone's groaning at me. Oh, yep. No time. No time to be cute about that. <laughs> the last time I was looking at glowing eyes in a clock tower, it ended frightfully bad for me. Ah, uh, could we slap on you? You brought your clone as well? Jeez, one scomo is enough for the world. We don't need extras. Bonza, mate, level up. Man, I'm just having a peach of a day with the fuzz on. I've got that tingly feeling that we might find the SMG or the uh, Dolce schematic some point soon. So I'll put that point into pistols and reload my pistol while I'm out of it as well. Might come in handy and save my life at some point. Oh, nice. Okay, I need to calm all of my farm. I'm getting way too rowdy. And just I'm just I'm just fucking pining. I'm just I'm at peak levels of woodly right now. Ooh, and a cheeky book. Don't mind if I do, thank you very much. I've forgotten exactly where it was. I know the stairs takes me all the way to the top, so I'll just go up here. There was definitely, past all the broken floorboards, a uh, a working or well, potentially working um, vending machine in here somewhere, wasn't there? Was it through you? Excuse me, coming in, whether you're ready or not, like I'm playing 40-40. Ooh, some books. No one protecting him, which is good. Knowledge is free. No, no one's here. Where the dickens was the bloody vending machine then? I've forgotten. There you were, there you were. Well, I'm pretty sure a false floor in front of you, but you are a uh, broken one. Which sucks, but I do need, what was it, like six iron, I think it was? Forged iron to make myself the uh, the workbench, so I'll break it down nice and quick and take all your guts back home with me. Just rip out the internals. Don't worry about being delicate about it. Here we go, up to the very last level. Not quite to the top where we have some very painful memories, but up high enough. But there is a safe in the corner of this building, isn't there? How you doing, bud? Sounds like there's some company coming up the stairs as well. Love their pajamas. Not about the pajamas. Like their bananas. Wearing pajamas. Hit you. Yep, get some space. I did hear you coming. Oh, it's another feral. Fuck it, pistols out then. Just put some points into it. May as well make it count. Ah, oh, the purple pistol. It's so good. Finding more and more lockpicks now as well, which I am all about. What have we got now? Nine lockpicks. I was cruising with one of those bad boys for a heckin' long time. I definitely thought there was more loot in here than there actually is. That's a bit upsetting. Savage country. Mm, scrap you because you're heavy armor, but there's also that. Oh, can we get there in one? Can we get there in one? We've got nine lock picks now. May as well give it a whirl. Who knows what might happen? Damn it. Bad things happen. Never mind. Well, you had the choice of the easy way or the hard way, and you made me do it the hard way, but, you know, it all, all's not the ends, but I still get into you one way or the other. Pop you open. Nice. Have a little gander inside and see what juices fall out. Ergonomic grip mod and some 44. Hmm, dang. All right, I'll quickly check the roof and see if there's anything up there. Maybe even some more bird's nest with some eggs in it for me. Just you. Just, oh, it's like a proper parapet. That's awesome. That's like a great way to take some cover. If they ever put in the bloody, um, what are the bandits? Things that have a range of it back at you. That's going to come in real handy. Another egg. Lovely dovely. There's a cement mixer just here. I am kind of on my way home because I am pretty hungry and I wouldn't mind putting some grub down me gullet before too long. Oh, hey buddy. Ooh, there's a vending machine in there. It's tempting me. It's tempting me. I don't even know what this place is, but it's luring me in with the promise of sweet treats. The only thing sketchier than this is like a white van pulling up with free candy written with a K on the side of it. Well, I come to think of it, eye candy is written with a K. Ooh, I've got even more sus. Search the mailboxes while I'm passing through. Nothing there. Not sure what I was expecting to find in people's letters other than paper. Have it squeeze through you. Ooh, casings. Scrap that and take the nails. Always check for lockpicks while we're here. Scrap and scrap and... Mm, scrap as well. All right. You are a worky T. See, I told you. It's sus as fuck. It's spelled with a K. Uh, but I will take, now that I have money falling out of my ears, I'll take both of you. Thank you very bloody much. I'll save you for when I really need you, like if I ever go and raid Dishong or something. Not just for regular garbage, but for the real good stuff. 
Dang, if only I had that when I popped the lockpicking candy before and hit all those hardened chests. That would have been a real good time. There's another clock tower just here and I can't resist to quickly just park my bike on you. Oh, yep, you're coming over to see what's what. That's fine. Stop right there. Thank you very much. I need someone with a crossbow touch. <laughs> my life is weird. Sydney's quoting Spice Girls to her camera. How did I get here? Always got to ring the bell for good luck. To pretend that goes bong. If they ever change that to make a bong sound effect, I will be very happy about it, but I'm not going to hold my breath on that one. Ooh, that's a proper hunting rifle. I mean, it's, it's doing more damage per bullet than the other stuff, but it's actually worthwhile to me. got no points into it. And even if I did, if I don't... I'm going to scrap it. In fact, I'm not going to scrap it. I'm just going to... I'm going to be a good, lovely survivor. I'm going to put that... And you know what? Here. Here. Here's a couple of rounds. If you choose to come to the clock tower, the sacred clock tower, and make it your home, there's a rifle and some ammo there for you, you know? Just trying to be generous. You know, trying to give back to the world that's given so much to me. I'm really bleeding hungry. I really am. Oh, there's another pawn shop, though. All my favorite POIs are out here. I just want to get inside all of them, one after the other. Where'd that bloody thing go? There it is. Oh, stupid tennis is coming over. <laughs> Speaking of getting into things one after the other, it's like I summoned you. Oh, damn, she always hits so hard. Not nothing there. Oh, God. Nope. Nope. Oh, boy. Woo! But I don't have any pegs. I can't give you a dink. Just calm down. There's the silhouette of me house. That's kind of like the other reason I wanted to live in the town hall. Is that it's so easy- Oh god. There you are. I was gonna say, I hear you flapping about behind me. Someone stick some zip ties on me helmet to keep me nice and safe. But living in the town hall means I can see that silhouette from so far away that I sometimes just forget what building you're living in or if you're going in the right direction. When you're a muppet like me, you need all the help and hands that you can possibly get. Quickly pull up out the front. So it's 20 past five. By the time I fed myself and wet myself, I can probably squeeze in one more raid. I guess I've got to keep hitting working stiffs, but so far it hasn't been working out well for me at all. It's going to take a bit too long, I think, to make myself the workbench while I'm here now. So I'll just quickly stuff my face. You're going to cook me a whole bunch of grilled meat. I'll come back for that later. Good, good. I'll also grab one of you because I'm pretty parched. I don't think... I don't think I need the eye candy just yet kind of a later thing like for like a real big POI if I go to any oh, look at that view though god I love this game uh if I go to the end of the big skyscrapers I'll use the looting candy there to make the most out of the loot rooms at the top of those but for now I hear footsteps that's okay I think I'm gonna head over that way I think there's a pretty good cluster of buildings over there need to find myself a working stiffs or something I've got to keep working to that method I've got to keep hoping I'll find what I need just just gotta pray. There's a working stiffs just here, but I feel like that's one I've already gone to. Is it? Mmm. I don't know, actually. The dumpsters are untouched outside, plus. Ooh, some more lockpicks, thank you very much. They're starting to come in hot and heavy, and I am here for it. The car's not rated either, so maybe this is an untouched spot. Okay. Plus, the parcel gas next door is getting me a little bit tingly as well. G'day, g'day. How's it going? What do you know? A strike a light. Hup. Oh, missed ya. Missed ya. I wanted the glory of the Spider-Man kill. Oh god, now they're all coming over. This was um this was more than I bargained for. So just gonna use my sweet new pistol skills to make hopefully short work of the lot is. <laughs> it's like the germs in Mr. Burns' body. Missed ya. Gotcha. Gotcha. Almost got you soon. Oh god, they're all coming in. There's so many targets out here. My knife's gonna go blunt on skulls. Got some extra food in old mate's pockets. Some shetty parts, steel tool parts. That's actually that's some pretty good gubs. That's some that's some very generous loot. I was gonna say it's a very generosity, but that's not how the English language works. So we'll just pretend it didn't happen and push on. Check all the loot. Guess someone's been stashing some guns in a retail environment. I mean, I know customers can be dicks sometimes, but that's getting a little bit out of hand. Oh, that's what did I fucking tell ya? There's another wrench. What are you doing? 53 for 18 compared to... What are you doing if I compare the two? 54. So my one is actually better, which means you're just going to get scrapped. I'll take the nails. Check the other uh, toolbox as well. I can hear the crickets chirping and the dingoes yelping. So it is getting pretty late on in the day. But I'm here. I'm here. I'm committed to murder. Nice. Good. I'm stuck. Ooh. 
What is happening with the chickens in this world? Why, why is every checkout chick a checkout chook? Do I want to know? <laughs> sure. sure. Sometimes it's best not to ask questions. Oh, God. Holy shit. Woo. Dingo. When you least expect it, that... That gave me a fright. That gave me a pretty solid fright, actually, if I'm being honest. Oh, man. Where did you even come from? Just out of bloody nowhere. I'll slurp up one of you. Don't mind if I do. Keep on pushing. Keep on going. Scrap, scrap, scrap. Take all of you. Oh, man. It's going to take me a moment to come to terms with that. This time around, I'm going to check the office first so I don't forget to later. All right, I was going to say, I thought there were some Muppets in here, but no, they're just outside. Well, that's fine. <laughs> you knocked on my door. It's like trick or treating, but for bullets. Anything else in here? Are you hiding something? No, you're not. All right. Oh, I guess. Oh. oh, the knife is getting good. Oh, I see you, pup. I see you, pupperini. Hang on a second. There we go. Take care of you first and foremost. Should be a box just at the back here with... Maybe someone on it, or maybe not. Just a pop. Ooh. Hmm. I mean, it's not what I was hoping for. I was hoping for like a Dolce or an SMG schematic, but anything compound archery. That's very tempting. Actually, I'm still only rolling a tier one crossbow. Would a compound bow? Yes. I mean, it's not even a question. Of course, a compound bow should be better than an iron crossbow. But I've turned all my arrows into scrap, and I uh, I don't I don't have any arrows anymore. I only have bolts. Who's barking away out here? Just you? That's fine. Go away. I've already dealt with your kind enough today. My heart rate's still up in the three figures. You can take that snarly snout and piss off somewhere else. Let's make this quick as time is running out. If we can get this done nice and quickly, I will be very happy about it. Wasn't too bad. Only shanked one of the shots, but cleaned up everybody else. Oh, uh-oh. Joshy learned how to use a gun. Look out, zombies. Look out all. Grab. Oh, easy. There you go. Get the one pixel that works. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Reload you, because I'm feeling good about it. <laughs> that, nothing there. Where's everything else? I miss anything? I don't think so. Let's go. Loot room. There is someone at the door, but it's going to take him a hot minute to get in here. I'm just going to not drink you, actually. Scrap you. Try and free up some space. I might need feathers. I'm going to be making myself some arrows. So I'll hold on to you. That can go away. That can go away. Uh, I'll keep you for the moment as well. All right. Nice. Forgot to open this one yet, though. Just make my life a bit easier in a moment. Good. Okay. What have we got? Come on. <sighs> steel tools. Not steel tool parts. Steel tools. No, that's just some frames. More frames. Hmm, it's really like wanting me to make my own stuff, isn't it? Read you, scrap you, take you guys. I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling the love. This isn't the bloody Lion King. I can't feel the love tonight. Is that it? Is that done? Dang, that's very disappointing. Well, no use hanging around then. Oh, it's looking very pink out here. For a second there, I thought maybe I'd misjudge some things and it was actually Horde Night tonight, but no, it's fine. It's only day 18. Oh, ooh, there's a vendor just over there as well at the coffee place. I'll check you on the way out as well. But first, any sneaky deities hanging at the back of the truck? Ooh, blade trap schematic. That could come in very handy. There's some been, been some recent discoveries in my life that uh has made me pretty partial to the odd blade trap. You're broken. Interesting. Very interesting. That might change some things for me. Nighttime has fallen, which means I'm probably going to have a bit of a fight on my hands at my front door. No, oh, no, you did see me, but you were coming after me only for a moment. There's a spider trundling about. All right, I'm just going to get up my ladder up to safety then. Don't mind me. Another successful day. Ow! There's bloody raindrops out of my eye, though. Someone get me some goggles. Okay. So I can't get steel tools, but I'm getting lots of steel tool parts, and I'm not really ever going to be able to put enough points into Minor 69er to make better tools than that. Nothing in use, so maybe I need to just bite the bullet and make some tier 1 stuff. Like, it's not going to be pretty. Ooh, I didn't even realize I got an anvil. Fuck, yeah, I needed one of those. Like, it's not going to be pretty, but it might do a better job. 
also, we know how seven days works. The moment I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say this quietly so the seven days gods don't hear. We know that if you invest the resources into making the tools, the game will just start giving you those tools in loot. It thinks it's gonna piss you off because you spent all those resources, but instead it's what you actually want. Yeah, good deal, good deal, good plan. So that's what I'm thinking. I'm never gonna spend the resources making it, so you better never give me the loot. Might have oversold that just a little bit, but that's okay. What is my go? Got 36 steel tool parts, and I've got only three steel on me. God, that's a good sight out there too, isn't it? Look at that. Look at that. Come on. I'm trying to kill zombies here, not get distracted by the wilderness. Okay, the first thing I do need to do though is grab you, 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 and both of you. Yep, that's all I needed for that. And make myself a workbench. Knock up one of those. Cheers, biggies. I've got no skill points available. What does it take? It's uh, minus 69, wasn't it? So you give me C2. So I, with, with my cigar on, I could get up to there and make uh, quality three fair tools. And given I'm only rolling fours and fives down here already, that's actually not too bad of a shout. So I'm two skill points away from making T3 steel tools. That might be the goer. That could be the goer. I'm, I'm here. I'm here for it. But I'm also starting to think... Knives just aren't that good for Horde Knights, so I might need to start- I've got a microphone now, sorry about that. I might need to start thinking about, is it you? You do give me 50% XP from the electrical trap kills. I don't want to start, like, building traps to kill zombies and not get any XP for it. I know I've been avoiding doing it because I refuse to do it just to get a workbench, but to actually, like, get some XP from killing stuff? 20% at tier 3, just into level 6. Oh, it's so expensive! I think that might have to be like a later Josh thing. I don't think I'm gonna be able to do that just yet. Focus on getting my steel tools. Plus it also gives me the passive stuff for like 20% block damage and, um, wait, what? Increase tool damage by 20% and block damage by 60. So is that like an 80% across the board increase in damage? That's a no brainer. I'll take that. Yes, bloody please, give me one of you. I okay, guess so that's the next thing I need to focus on after my workbench is done. I do have five bow parts as well, actually. What's it gonna take to make a compound bow? Five bow parts. It's almost too good to be true. I mean, I suppose just for like the experiment, just to see if it's worthwhile. I have been liking the crossbow though. Mm, if only I had to found that one. I'd have swapped that in a heartbeat, but change it over to that. I'm not sure. What do you guys reckon? Compound bow or iron crossbow? Someone tell me what the right answer is here. Because I just don't know. There we go. Workbench is done. Chuck you onto that one. And whack you down. Oh, yeah, I suppose that side. That side will do. A nice little layout going out up here as well. Okay, I do have compound bow. I've got the stuff to make. I had to break down some beds downstairs to get the springs, but that's fine. Oh, you're only going to take 26 seconds. But you know what? Because I'm an asshole, I'm not going to show you what the stats are going to be. I'm going to leave it on that cliffhanger just because I can. And you'll have to come back and see what those stats are on that compy bow in the next episode because this episode is done. So thank you guys for watching. Most of all, thank you to the patrons of Patreon who made this episode possible. If you like to make sure you hit the like button down below and subscribe to this channel. Follow me on Twitter. If I don't talk to you there first, I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.